One of the world's first machine guns fired two types of bullets, round ones for shooting at a Christian enemy, and square ones which were far more damaging for killing Turks. The inventor, a London lawyer named James Puckle, designed the flintlock machine gun in 1718 for use on board ships, claiming in his patent application that it discharges so often and so many bullets can so quickly be loaded as it renders it next to impossible to carry a ship by boarding. The gun was not the most portable of weapons, however. It was heavy, with a bore of one and a half inches, and a barrel nearly three foot long. The barrel mounted on a tripod had a firing drum that held 11 preloaded chambers, which could be hand revolved by the gunner. At a public demonstration in 1722, a puckle gun discharged 63 bullets in seven minutes. The impressed authorities put the weapon into production, but it proved too cumbersome and hard to load in action, and the puckle gun was soon no more than a military curiosity. Three examples survive, one in Copenhagen and two in the Tower of London. Both London models, one of brass and one of iron, are fitted with the square firing chambers.